today I am gonna show you this this how this much play-doh eggs. We have about eight play-doh eggs and this one is really decorated because it has all those beads but on the back it does not. And we have mini we have mini eggs and big eggs. Up here's the big ones and down here's the little ones. And there's also mini play dohs Here's a purple one. Here's a green one. Here's a turquoise one. And here's a blue one. And um, the top ones are pretty interesting. So if you were guessing why does it have different colors. Because now on, this is pink and that is red. I'm guessing. Here's a closer look at that egg. And yes, I am missing a bead. So, enough of the chitter chatting. And now, let's start opening. So, the first one I'm going to do is this purple one in the front row. Let's see what's inside. And whoa, we got two things in here. We have got tin. A rainbow balloon ring, which is a fish tail. So I know a lot about rainbow balloon. Here's your rainbow balloon ring. Here's a closer look at it. It's kind of blurry. Here's a closer look and a clearer look. And it's a rainbow color, if you notice. So I am going to place that right there. And then there's something else inside that I just realized. And it is a triple single bracelet. <coughs> so I like that too. Because I really like rainbow bracelets. Let's sit that down there. And I'm going to place my purple Play-Doh to the side. So it doesn't bother us. And now, which one should I do? I'm going to do a top one, which is going to be this, this green one. And this green one is um, shapes and size. It's a shape, <coughs> shape and sizes because it is green and it has, it's a square shape. So let's open this up. Yeah. It was pretty hard to get into, and we have gotten a pretty pink flower ring. And there is a little bit still Play-Doh on my hands, so <coughs> that's really cool. Here's the back of it, and I am going to set that down right here in the front row. And then I'm going to place that, my green Play-Doh, to the side. <coughs> now I'm going to get one from the top, which is this purple one, <coughs> which has a to the toy sticking out there. So you could, it's kind of a clue that's inside. So I'm going to open it up from here. And... I guess that is a can of bubbles. So that's a can of bubbles. It's still kind of like covered in Play-Doh indefinitely right there. And I just realized that it came with a tattoo. Oh, wow. Came with a tattoo also. And I'm going to set that down right here in the front row. And then set this bubbles down. And this is new. Nobody has ever used this before. That's the good thing about it. And a lot, now a lot of people said if I could put my face in some of the videos and 
my cousin also asked me that. And now um, I'm going to say, and I might do it in one of the videos. So if you said that to me, you're lucky. So <coughs> now I'm going to do one of this one. It's another shape and size because it's a stick. Take a closer look at it. It's kind of blurry. And now we are going to open it up. And that was quick. So I easily figured it out really quickly. What is it? So this is an Elsa and Anna crayon. <coughs> and um, it's a yellow crayon, as you see. So if your favorite color is yellow, you're in good luck. And there's also Olaf here, which is pretty funny. And my favorite character is Elsa. And my second one is Olaf, since he's super funny. So I'm going to place that right there. All of it is in the front row by now. So next up, I am going to do this one. So this one's also shapes inside since it's a flat Play-Doh egg. So, ooh, that's quick. So the crazy thing about it is that it has a cross sticker on it. So here it is. I'm going to take the sticker off, put it away. And then this one, it's hard to take off, but here's a close look at the suitcase. Here's the back of it. And now I'm going to open it up. <coughs> and then, uh, wow, we have an Elsa sticker, which is pretty cool because we just opened up Elsa and on a um, crayon. And here's a closer look at it. She's all blue, so... I'm going to place her right there. <coughs> and now it's our candy time. We have um, the same candy as this one. Because in another video, we I have gotten this candy. So that's pretty cool. And this ca kind of candy I really like. So I'm going to place that right there and get this out of our way. And then, now I'm going to do this one, the front wall. We're heading down to our last ones. That was easy to open. So, by now, we have gotten the jack. I, this, um, this, I don't know if I've done it in another video or not, but I, it, I really like jack, so I just decided I wanted to do it, so... And the, um, I pl you place it on your floor, then you spin it around. But I'm really bad at doing it. What I'm trying to do is spin it and then make it spin on the floor. And whoa, I got it. Doing that. So I really like playing with this jack. So it's not that a bad toy for me. So I'm going to place that right there. Now I'm going to open up this orange egg that's kind of stuck and it just was well, knocking a little bit of stuff down. So I'm going to open this up. And in another video, I have said that we are going to open up a lot of these. I'm going to probably open up a lot of these. And probably I'll do this in every single Play-Doh egg video, but I have no idea. Ugh. This is really hard to open. I got it open. So, we have gotten a Olaf sticker, which I'm really excited about. And this, you, um, these stickers, you could actually color them in. The Olaf one is the easier one, but the Elsa one isn't that easy. So, I'm going to place them right next to each other. And we, oh wow, we have also gotten the honest sticker. Which is pretty neat because she's all pink, my favorite color. So I'm going to get 
them right next to each other since they're sisters. And place Oba right there. And we have gotten a cute teddy bear that I had no idea if I did in the video or not again. And it's all covered in blue Play-Doh. That's dry. If you're DCTC watching this video, then um, I'm thinking you'll have this because I watch a lot of your videos and I'm a big fan of yours. So, um... I'm going to sit that right down, right there, and I'm going to place this away as well. And then it's really messy here, and we have gotten an eraser shaped like a mountain, and a note that says, God loves you. Here's a closer look at it kind of blurry getting clear yeah there you go it's really clear now so it says God loves you and if you could see it has a little period at the end and again my hands are still really it's so it's really blurry by now and now last but not least we're moving on to our very last egg which is this pinkish rich egg a bee just fell off, of course. So it'll be a long time to take all of these beads off, but it could all automatically fall, though. So I'm just going to open it up. So it automatically popped open. And that play was really sticky because it's really sticking to my hands, mostly my dub. And the first that we got is another tattoo, but a bigger tattoo because it's a big butterfly tattoo. I'm going to place that right next to our tattoo, our little tattoo. And we have gotten a stamp that says Jesus on it, what I really like. And we have gotten a light up ring that lights up. Here's what it sees like, kind of likely in the dark. So it's blue, red, blue, red, blue, red. And you just twist it, then it lights up. I didn't twist it. And then I'm going to get this red plate all away. And, oh, wait. We have gotten another note that says, I forgive you. And these notes, what I realized about them is that they're nice notes because they say nice things about it. So it's getting a little dark. So I'm glad that it was getting a little dark so we could do this. It's really light on the camera, really. It's like a light up ring for me. And I am going to sit that right there and move that away. And I'm going to place this there and this there. And soon, but a little later, a little later, um, in a few months or a few weeks or a few days, we are going to do like egg videos where it's like chocolate eggs and probably mashums or fashions. So please subscribe if you like this video. Bye!